What's up guys, today we'll talk about um, how to fix missing network adapters and I will show you how to do this on uh, Windows 10, Windows 8 and Windows 7. So basically I will give you three solutions what will work on all Windows versions. As well I will attach this uh, link to my blog post in the description below so you can uh, click on it and find all this method here with detailed instructions. So uh, let's start. So first of all uh, what we need to do is uh, we need to go to uh, click on start menu, click on computer, right click here, click on properties and here we are on Windows 7, it's device manager. So open device manager and you will see window like this one. So uh, here we need to click on view and click on show hiding devices. So uh, same as on my blog post as you can see. So once this is done, uh, you need to click on actions and click on scan for hardware changes if uh, you click on actions and do not have such options you can also click here scan for hardware changes so uh, if uh, check to see if a problem is resolved and if it doesn't help you then uh, move to method number two so uh, the second method is uh, Usually this method will help to most of you. So what you need to do is you need to update drivers. So in uh, if you click on device manager and you will see like uh, other devices, unknown device, you should click on it, right click and try to update it. If you have software for it, of course. Uh, and there are two, two uh, options how to update manually and uh, automatically so if you want to download drivers manually you should go to one of these websites it depends on uh, what computer you are using in my case I'm using Dell drivers so I will click on this link to go to official website where you can download drivers here you need to enter Dell service tag but you can find uh, if you are using laptop, you can find this tag under your cover. So uh, flip your uh, laptop and you will see such service tag. And here you will see the number. Otherwise, you can click on detect PC and it will, uh, it will detect your computer, detect your version. And here, if you scroll, you can able to download drivers also let's search for wi-fi for example here is wi-fi driver ethernet controller driver you can download both and after that your computer should be working okay and the, this solution should help you uh, if it still doesn't work you reset computer but problems still still you still have this problem go to solution free reset bios to reset BIOS, you need to start your computer, um, and uh, when you will see first screen, it will look like this, some, something similar like this. And here you will see below message how to enter BIOS setup. So uh, you may be able to see uh, notifications such as press delete or enter to set up or escape. Maybe just need to press F2 and it can so uh, when you will enter on uh, on bias you will see such screen so this means you are in bias so we need to go to we need to load setup default so usually this can be found here when you click on exit menu so let's click on load setup defaults and it will reset um, bias so after restart your computer problem should be resolved and finally if it still doesn't work then uh, you have you have big bigger problem and you need to change your network interface controller card so 
So uh, you need to find out what uh, network card you are using and you need to replace it. So guys, I hope this video was helpful. I will put this uh, post what I have created on my website in the description below. So make sure to click on it and read this carefully, follow these steps. And for any questions, please comment on this video. Have a nice day. Bye.